what is going on guys welcome back to detroit to become human episode 7 with me cxc in this episode by the look of it we're going to be picking up as kara going to be continuing her story so this is todd here asleep he's basically our master and we're his android his servant or his slave or whatever you want to say however you want to put it somewhat derogatory but that's what we are i'm just laying out the facts dinner is ready yeah, yeah, I'm coming. I'm going to try not to talk over any of the characters. I'm going to let you guys enjoy the story, but I'm just going to say there's new episodes dropping on here every six days. New video on the channel every other day. Make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all of the content that's going to be dropping. But we're going to be jumping into the story of Detroit to become human. So we've served dinner. Turn on the lights! I can't see shit. Okay. Turn the lights on. Stop moving around! For Christ's sake, you're making me nervous! What are you looking at? What's your fucking problem? Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Maybe you think this is easy. Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. My fault your fucking mother took off. You should stop taking drugs, Todd. Sometimes you really scare me, Todd. Fucking bitch took off without a word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking account. Fucking fault! Get back here. Come back here? Come back here right now! You stay there. Don't you dare fucking move, or I'll bust you worse than last time. Okay, so by the sound of it, he's already had a robot. I could have been happy. I could have had a family. But no! I didn't even give a shit about how I felt. I did everything I could to make her happy. It just, it just wasn't enough. I just wasn't good enough for her! Fucking brat! Oh, it's all her fault! Yeah. I gotta teach her some respect! Mm Daddy's very mad! You deserve to be taught a good lesson! A good fucking lesson. Okay, so obviously we've got to go and help this little girl. There's no question about that. So we've got to do what we've got to do to get free of this situation. Boom, so we broke free. I'm guessing that's breaking out of the programming. And now we've got to protect Alice. That's the objective. This is hard to watch, like I don't like this kind of situation to be honest. In real life or even just depicted in a movie or a game like these kind of things I would stay away from. So I'm guessing we've got to find some kind of protection or some kind of defence. We did see the weapon last time we were in the house. I think there's a gun upstairs in the drawer of Todd's bedroom, I believe. We 
leave her alone. What the fuck are you doing? Put down the gun and get the fuck out of here. That's an order! No! I want you to leave her alone. You want? What do you mean you want? What are you gonna do? You gonna shoot me, is that it? Are you gonna shoot a human? You seem to have a problem. I think we need to fix that. <clears throat> So, yeah, that happened. But yeah, to be honest, I was a little bit... I don't know, like, on the fence about this game. Like, I weren't sure if the story was going to be that fun or anything. Like, obviously, I've never had any kind of interaction with this game or anything. I heard it was meant to be good. And I can see why now. Like, I'm definitely getting more into it. Now, now there's a little bit more action. Okay, guys, so this was actually a really heavy episode, but either way, I hope you enjoyed. I've tried not to speak too much over the characters, let you guys enjoy the story. But that's actually going to do it for me. Make sure to subscribe to stay updated. There's a new episode in six days. If you don't want to wait till then, there's a new video, not tomorrow, but the next day, which I believe is Thursday. That's going to be Assassin's Creed Valhalla episode 32. So thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next episode.